Four years ago, Sarah wanted to get a second dog. So her dad told her that she would have to pay for it. So we started saving up money to pay for her second dog. When we got enough money for him, he said that she didn't have to pay for it. So we decided to start raising money for every non-killed dog shelter in Vermont. We then spent the summer working really hard with lemonade stands, continuing to walk dogs, and raised $100 to donate to the Humane Society of Chinook County, our first one. Then we kind of just made it our goal, after we experienced how happy they were with our donation, we made it a goal to donate $100 to every non-killed dog shelter in Vermont. Well, our goal is to finish by the end of this year. And we started four years ago, and we were like eight and nine, so we weren't making much money then. Since we started doing paw wax, it's definitely picked up and started going a lot faster, which is good. Paw wax is a wax that helps with dogs um, to protect their paws from the ice, snow, and salt. Like when they spread salt, it can hurt the, um, animals' paws and make them really dry. Um, and it's also helping in like Florida on the beaches, the like salt from the salt water can help the paws because they can get dropped and cracked and dry. We just, this is our lavender one. We make it out of shea butter, olive oil, coconut oil, beeswax, and then some all natural essential oils that are great for the dogs. We sell it at Guy's Farm and Yard, Pet Food Warehouse, in a place in Montpelier called Corky Pet. And in addition to that, we'll occasionally do lemonade stands and sometimes walk a few neighborhood dogs along with pet sitting and just taking care of them while people are away. So we have our Instagram that my sister runs, the A and Maps. She runs it and she kind of tracks all of our stuff so we have a, a fair following on there. But our I'd say that our main way that we get people to hear about us is from other people to hear about us either from shelters or from just people talking. So we've raised 3000 so far and we have another donation ready. We've donated to about five during COVID. So $500.